We are ending this newscast on kind of a sad note tonight because we're saying goodbye to our good friend and colleague, Glenn Mills. Where are you going, Glenn? Well, I'm heading back home. My career's coming full circle. Uh, heading back to Salt Lake City, Utah, I took a job with the ABC affiliate there. But I've got to say, this seven-year run has been completely amazing. I'm going to miss a lot of people here, and it all starts with you guys right here. Well, congratulations to you, and Thank that's you. not only a significant jump, but as you mentioned, you're going home because you yep. grew up in Sandy, Sandy, you, Utah. Sandy, yep. Utah. So yep. you're not going to be far from home. <laughs> and and nope, we not have at had all. so much fun over the years. A, a lot of humor behind the scenes. Um, so much fun. That's what people don't get to see is is the laughter that we get to have. We're going to have a little bit of video of Glenn in just a minute, but uh, we really wanted to give you any final words you have for the audience and the viewers. And you've been so involved yeah. in the community mm -hmm. as well. Yeah, I appreciate that it it really has been an honor to be part of this team and I want to thank all of you at home for letting us into your uh, living room each night some people have told me they that I put them to bed on a nightly basis <laughs> kind of weird yeah. but or is that asleep or to bed a well I'm hoping to bed <laughs> hopefully not to sleep but honestly this is a great community it has been an honor to be a part of it my work in Rotary and with the Salvation Army the Mace County Junior Football Association I have made a lot of great friends here and and the lifestyle here has really suited me well I love mountain biking I love hunting I love fishing so I'm definitely going to be back yeah. okay best moment any memories there uh, well I'd have to say the food drive that's been a big part of my stay here and uh, thanks to you the community we've been able to uh, make significant strides in in the food drive and it went a long way in, in helping the people of Mesa County less fortunate, for sure. Absolutely. We wish you the best of luck, Glenn, and thank Bless you so much. Blessings thank to you. you. Blessings. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> All right, we've got that video now. We're going to send it out with a look at Glenn and some of the fun times he's had over the years. Good evening, and thanks for joining us for KKCO 11 News on MeTV. I'm Glenn Mills, <laughs> and I'm Glenn Mills. It's a pretty common sight these days, someone chugging down a bottle of water. But the question tonight is, do we really need eight of these a day? Oh! Oh! <laughs> you guys, you may remember the announcement from District 51 last year that it was going to build that new elementary school. Volunteer ringing the bell. You want to pay me to go along with viewers on a vacation. Naturally, I told them if you're going to twist my arm like that, I'll try to find a way to make it happen. The first for me, no doubt about that. We are broadcasting live 40 feet in the air. Holy cow. Hear ye, hear ye, hear ye. Sportscaster Phil, procrastinator of all procrastinators, sees his shadow. Ah! 